Hi, my name is Bron Gondwana. I'm from Fastmail, based in Australia, and I work with a lot of different email protocols, um, in particular working with a new protocol called JMAP, which we're bringing through the IETF as a standard for the internet. The motivation for building a new protocol for email is that IMAP, which is the current open standard for email, wasn't designed for the modern internet, particularly IMAP in combination with CalDev and CardDev to give you contacts and calendars, which you require for a full email client experience. It's very difficult for new developers to learn how to use. It's quite resource hungry. And we saw that we needed to build our own protocol to make our own service work nicely. There was a case for building an open protocol for this. We decided to bring it to the IATF as the place to build an open standard. A significant challenge was working out a JSON format that was expressive enough to carry the entire MIME structure of an RFC 5322 email while still being simple for new developers to discover and easy to work with for basic messages. The initial representation that we brought to the IATF when we first proposed JMAP was great for simple emails and for simple clients, but it didn't scale out to the full capability of emails. After brainstorming and experimenting with a few ideas within the working group, we came up with a way in which clients could fetch full properties and some aliases to make it easy to fetch common properties that meant that we had a fully structured way of fetching the entire message while it was still simple for new developers. JMAP's robust data synchronization model will allow us to extend easily to calendars and contacts, which gives the rest of the personal information management framework that people expect from a modern client. The IATF process has made JMAP a much better protocol. The collective industry representation within the IATF meant that we wound up with a simpler and more consistent protocol designed to handle use cases that the initial authors didn't have experience with. It's more regular, it's more extensible, and it has the experience of a lot more server developers than we had when we came in here, so we know that it will be implementable in a large number of servers. We believe that this free and open standard will help developers around the world create a better email experience for everyone. The email and core documents are now in the editor queue at the IATF. They'll be published as proposed standard RFCs. To have it standardised gives us the support and the momentum we need to bring it to the world.